you guys welcome back to my channel vibing at the door underscore with mo and if you're new to my channel how about hit that subscribe button and if you're a returning subscriber how about send it to a family or friend so they can vibe out with us and please 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 hit that like button that helps out a lot and thanks in advance all right you guys i'm not gonna be due to doing too much of a talking i have a video to play y'all of mama d like she's basically saying more things about bambi in a negative way talking about her and her own love and hip-hop and how she's not a good friend and all sorts of things in that nature but y'all look at the video and y'all let me know what y'all think about it in the comment section below i do comment back and i'll catch you guys on the next video bye known i should have known but i didn't see no warning signs so after she had the really the second baby y'all yeah yeah then it really started coming out yeah and then remember me and my son fell out in vegas last season she was the cause of that yep she talked him into cussing his own mom out she ain't and separating from anytime somebody pulls you from your family estrange you from your family not just me my whole family how about my dad is 87 y'all and he never met um xylo and kelly until easter sunday that's the god's honest truth yeah she's been playing them games with me and my family y'all don't know it but i'm i'm happy to say that i'm happy to tell you what's up y'all i'll just know that bambi's full of lies and she's deceitful and she she's a con artist. That's what she's been taught to do. Cause her mama did that. Um, when I'm I'm gonna launch my lashes on TV this season, so you'll get all that then. But thank you. No, she ain't shit. Don't come from Compton. And then all the mothers they got teenage boys and on up. Just you know what I mean. Or either got daughters that men don't. You know that that's hurtful to a mom. And then for me to know the her truth, and then don't say nothing. And then you're going to try to take Scrap and make him look a certain kind of way on TV? I am. I'm going to have a, another casket. I'm going to get a glass casket now so everybody can see her laying in it, you know? Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let the church say amen. Mm-hmm. Well, I can't hear. Tell me, read. You have to tell me. I can't, I ain't got my reading glasses, y'all. Yeah, that's why I told, I told um, Rashida, she better be glad why she taking up for the band. Because had Kurt went another way, and you know he already had before. Hey, he went another way, she, she'll she be having his baby, having Kurt baby. You just never know. So all men, y'all be well. Well, them. don't believe them, this woman say. Because if you got some money, if you're an NBA or NFL or anything that she feels she can, that she don't have to work for her life, she can just put out her hand. That's what she doing. That's what she doing. That's what she doing. But them children need to be taken care of, keeping it 100. Yeah, he should have to give her something. You damn right. You got that right. Because I'm a, I'm a woman and I'm a mother. So, yeah. She, she should be giving some, but don't marry a man just to get have babies, just so when you something happen, the only thing you want is all his money. So, because I would be hurt. Like, I would be heartbroken, me and my husband were going through a divorce with no kids. Because I actually, like, I really love Ernest. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we go through the bullshit, but now I get through checking his ass and line him back up again and straighten him up and freak him out. He'd be all right. Man. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. And you would think, what woman don't have a mama? And because you know her mama seeing her Instagram. Why you don't get on the phone and say it, Bambi? Get off. First of all, uh, you, it's certain things as a mother. It's certain things as a woman that we don't, you know. If a nigga, if she on her fans only page, she need to show them her fans only. I know she thirst trapping. She thirst trapping. So, but I still, if if Ernest cheated on me and we going through a divorce, I wouldn't let no man have me because I I wouldn't want to be around no man. I've had enough for a minute, you know. I just want God to cleanse me, and you know, and be to myself as a woman. I wouldn't go from man to man. That's not how you do things because it it cheapens you. It really does, Tammy. It cheapens you. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. It disgraced yourself. Y'all go on her Instagram. And tell her to put some damn clothes on. Learn how to be a mother first. Yeah.
Yeah, look, I'm getting the backyard together, y'all. I'm getting it together, honey. I'm getting it together, honey. Yes, honey. There go Tam Tam. Yeah, we getting it together, honey. Pickles. Hey, Pickles. Say hey. Hey, hey everybody. They go Neiman Marcus, y'all. They go Neiman. They go Neiman. Yeah. So what they saying? Read it to me. Yeah, she got a fans on the page. So go on now. Come tell us what you got on there, y'all. Come tell us so the lawyer know. <sighs> Tramp. This is worse than a, a, a woman in their 40s still trying to show they behind. Show they, they butt nakedness. Oh, she, is she 40? Is she 50? Um, she in the middle. She middle age. She middle age. Honey, uh, I know her mama's 65. Because I'll be 60 in September. Uh-uh. Scrapping didn't know until a year ago how old she was. Yeah, because he seen her passport when they was coming in from um, Puerto Rico or somewhere. He seen it. Shocked him. But I was mad at him at that point. You mean you don't date the girl, marry the girl, and didn't know how old was. Mama, she told me she was 36. Scrap it. Come on. That's what the word dating means, to get to know somebody, not hop in bed with them. So Scrappy has some faults in this. Yeah, he has some faults in this. He's not without fault. Trust me. Yeah, the mama's 65. And still, I know a guy that drive a Maserati girl. How about the guy came and told me he met CeCe girl. He f***ed that same. She, to my having a man, is he. Apple falls the tree. Yeah, the apple, it don't do it. The apple don't fall. So don't let her lie. You see what she did to Imani. Um, it's not really a surprise she's doing this to my son, Lion. Be safe until he get through with this. So y'all pray. Pray for him. Pray for all of us. Pray for her. Pray that she learned what the, the word truth means. The word truth. Yep. Yeah. Because she has no integrity. Define integrity. Somebody need to tell her what integrity is. But she don't know where we know a lot of stuff about her. When she y'all gonna learn it this season. So she gonna lie until some of that truth start coming out, then she gonna be caught red handed. But Mama Deal make sure she stay keep y'all updated, okay? Lying on TV. Don't 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 believe nothing that woman say. It can be the sky can be gray. And I see it's great, but just because it can't. Yeah, she tried, yeah, and she run, and Sierra them don't know. She talk about Sierra and Erica Mena like a dog. Because Imani done came and told me stuff that Bambi had said about them. Yeah, and, and Scrappy told Bam um, last season, y'all, to befriend Sierra and Erica Mena so she can get more scenes. Yep, so she can get more episodes. That's exactly what Scrappy told her. Said, go ahead and be Sierra Friends and Erica Miller. Then you can be seen on TV more. Now, he trying to tell her so she can make money. And this bitch trying to break my son. Ain't that son? When a man can have your back, but you turn around and slander his name. You think I'm going to allow her to continue to do that? Okay. Um, the show is on now. The first uh, episode of Love and Hip Hop is on We TV now, not BH1. We on We TV. Come on Tuesday, eight o'clock. Now you know MTV got more than one channel. It's two of them. So just make sure you find the right channel on MTV on Tuesday night, eight o'clock. Okay? MTV, no more BH1. Okay? So the first um, thing came on last week, on last Tuesday. The uh, the second episode coming on this coming Tuesday, y'all, eight o'clock MTV. Okay, just know when you hear her lie, just laugh, just laugh. Say, oh boy, Mama D gonna get her. Mama D gonna get her. Yep, I'm gonna bust her wide open. It's God. Say, what's your podcast name? Um, um, Church and Street with Mama D. We're talking about the Bible and we're talking about the street, like the mean streets, the streets that that I sold and pimped and and just be honest, just be honest about everything. You know, I came from a middle-class family. I went to the Cato High School. I left there and went to Turner High. Yeah, tell the truth. Girl, you making up colleges. You ain't even never went in the parking lot of that college. But Cece stepped in the high-rise and told told somebody I was a bad, um, what she called me? Uh, she, she called me, say I was a bad grandmother, her mother. Girl, you smoke, girl. And you didn't even raise Bambi and her, and her brother. And her brother can't stay out of prison. He in and out. See, that's what I'm telling you. See, Scrappy should have never messed with no uh, woman that mama and brother stay in and out of jail. I should have known. But I... I